Coming up next, it's a welterweight showcase between dangerous Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt, Damian Maia and Gunnar Nelson. Gunnar Nelson looking to prove once again that he's one of the best in the world. This guy has world-class choking techniques in all varieties, be it guillotine, choke, rear naked, Dars, anaconda. If this guy gets a hold of your neck, you've got problems. Gunnar Nelson steps inside the octagon, and he's ready to fight. Born and raised in Sao Paulo, Brazil, Damian Maia, who made his UFC debut back in 2007 in Cincinnati, Ohio. His hero, not surprisingly, is Hickson Gracie. And over the years, the Southpaw has become a very good striker as well. Damian Maia, one of the masters of submission, set to fight here tonight. Damian Maia has a ridiculous Brazilian jiu-jitsu game. He is incredibly technical, and when he gets a hold of you, he is like a constrictor. Damian Maia, ready to battle in the octagon against Gunnar Nelson. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. Maia is 11 years his elder. The rest is virtually identical. And with the official introductions, here's the veteran voice of the Octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds of the UFC Walter White Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a grappler, holding a professional record of 14 wins, two losses, and one draw. He stands five feet eleven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of record of Iceland, Gunner! And now his opponent fighting out of the red corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter holding a professional record of 22 wins, 6 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Sao Paulo, Brazil. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. Herb Dean will be our referee. Ready to fight. Ready. And here we go. Fight scheduled for three five-minute rounds. White trunks for Nelson. Black trunks for Maya. Damian Maya has some outstanding takedowns. Look for them to be a big factor in this fight if he can execute them. And he continues to mix up his strikes. Oh! Big swing and a miss by Nelson. Trying to grab the leg, and he does. Maya gets the early takedown. He transitions into north-south. Maya gets it back to side control. That's a big elbow, Joe. Huge elbow. He's got the full mount, Joe. He's got the back. This is where he's outstanding. Yeah. Connected there. Got his back again. Flattened out. Maya's got the full mount again. That he lands a huge nasty elbow, elbow to the head. Side control here again. I need you to move. Scramble. Yeah. 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 This is where those knees to the body can come and play. Just over two on the clock. 
Postures up here. He's got the arm trap, Joe. Nice sweep. Now he's in the guard. Oh, he sweeps. Look at his position now. Big left hand he connected with. Big He's elbow. Smash. Oh, look at this! Unbelievable! That's how good Damian Maya is. Unbelievable. Beautiful ground and pound KO. Let's check out the action on our fight replay. And let's look at the replay and see the end of this fight. This is the huge ground and pound strike that lands for the KO. There it is again. And here we see it again. Bam! Lights out. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at 3 minutes, 47 seconds of the very first round. Playing the winner by knockout, Demian Maia! Demian Maia! Victorious with the knockout.